Hi everyone, welcome back to my channel and welcome to another video. Firstly, I've got blonde hair. <laughs> I think this is the first time it's going to be seen on YouTube. It is part of a video that's my hair, it wasn't my favourite video to film, I'll tell you that. But yes, I'm blonde again. If you didn't know, I used to dye my hair all the time, like bleach it properly blonde. And I didn't, I haven't done it in about almost two years. So she's blonde, she's back, and I love it. In other news, I am moving to uni in four days. Am I nervous? Yes. Am I terrified? Yes. So this video is very late. It is a massive... <laughs> Freshers uni haul if you haven't got that already from title and thumbnail. Yeah, I was gonna do this a lot earlier But um, I'm really disorganized and all of my stuff has only just arrived. So we're finally filming it I am moving to a self-catered student halls and it's also got an ensuite So I've got loads of bathroom stuff and loads of kitchen stuff I think I'm gonna start with my bedroom stuff because that's kind of more fun the first thing I have right in front of me are two pillows because I'm really fussy and I sleep with four pillows every night and so they give you two pillows uh, already so I bought another two also for my bed I bought this mattress topper everything is from either next Ikea or Dunelm Dunelm is amazing this was also from Dunelm it sits upside down I've got a topper on my bed anyway because my mattress isn't very nice um, and it just makes it considerably nicer and then for on my bed I have two of these pillows these are from next it's very basic because that's my style but it's crushed velvet pillows one side is pink and one side is gray i've got two of them so actually i think they were 18 pounds each and then some other little pillows i've got this little gray i can't if you can't tell i'm obviously going for pink and gray because i'm basic as i just said this one is from primark funny story i actually bought this four years ago um, at Reading festival because i threw up on my pillows i had to buy one and this has been with me ever since and she is now coming to uni and then the last pillow i have i've also had for a while this is g for gemma obviously but this one was from oliver bonus going with my nice little gray theme that i've got going on finally for my bed i bought this i mean it's let's take it out of this bag it's a big fluffy gray blanket again this was done elm 12 pounds beautiful goes perfectly with my theme then also for my bedroom i'm literally just pulling these out of the box that they're all in i've got these little drawer inserts there's some little ones and then some larger ones probably going to use this for my makeup because i have quite a lot and i don't want to just like throw it in a drawer and then other storage things so i have this little box which i obviously haven't built yet it's from ikea you can kind of see there what it's gonna look like this is just for my desk probably to put like paracetamol and don't know glasses <laughs> random stuff in it because i don't want to just like clutter my room so if i have a little box of just junk just so that everything keeps a little bit tidier and then i have these two you can see again i haven't built them yet but these match that little box and these are two magazine files because i am actually studying at university so i'm gonna have a lot of like paperwork and stuff then obviously like every other human every other teenager i bought some led lights i don't have any in my room and these are actually mains connected to led lights which is not allowed i also don't know how i would stick this to my walls because you're not allowed to stick anything obviously an essential that you see on every packing for freshers tiktok that i've ever seen in my life an extension cable i've got one and it's got four plugs on it perfect for my phone laptop camera and a hair straightener <laughs> pretty much is all i use then this is really cute i have one of these already on my makeup desk right now my brother actually got it for me for my 18th and it's so pretty it's perfect i put my like sponges in here big brushes and then like eyeshadow brushes and then i do have some battery powered fairy lights i've got kind of a big blank wall in front of my bed so i'm gonna hang up these all along there and then i've got a big mirror downstairs from ikea i couldn't be bothered to bring it upstairs and then take it back down four days later so i haven't got it to show you 
but it's just a big mirror. Next, I have lots of these. So these are little command hooks. They've got like fairy lights up here. So I decided that that's exactly what they must be for. So that's how I'm gonna hold up my fairy lights. And then I have the really big ones, which apparently hold up 7.2 kilos. And my mirror is only meant to be like six. So it should work. And then I have some poster strip, poster command strips, which I have basically printed out loads of free prints, obviously. My uni room is gonna look the same as every other girl moving into uni. And then this is very random, but I bought a diary. I actually need to start this because I want to start being more organized. It looks like this. I don't know if you can see, but it's got all the days of each week. And then I'm gonna do morning afternoon and evening i think but yeah it's also really pretty and rose gold like everything else i have a ridiculous amount of these hangers again these were from oh no these were from amazon actually they also sell the exact same ones in primark i'm pretty sure but they are the white velvet with like um rose gold hardware but apparently velvet hangers are the best because no clothes fall off them which is great because my clothes like to do that a lot and so i've got a stupid amount of these i'm not going to need all of them because my wardrobe is tiny i have more drawer dividers these ones are from ikea i think these ones i'm probably going to use for like underwear i don't know what the drawer situation is going to be like hopefully they're the right size i have no idea and then these are really important these are from ikea as well they are hooks that you put on over the top of your doors. So I've got two, one for my bathroom door and one for my bedroom door. Oh, that's what it looks like. And then the last things that I got are these because I've watched a room tour of what I think my room is gonna look like on YouTube. Obviously, I'm not exactly sure until I get there, but the wardrobe has like a big shelf at the top of it. And I don't wanna just like throw stuff up there because it'll get so messy. So I bought three of these to like keep I guess stuff that I'm not really going to use as much, I'll keep them at the top. Okay, now a few bathroom things. This is a hanging shower storage. You can kind of see the image on the back there. Because the shower has zero storage in it and I have a lot of things to keep in the shower. And then also from Ikea, I just got this really little toothbrush thingy. And then I've got a whole bag of white stuff here there's all in the same like it all matches so i'll just show you one and tell you what i've got so i've got a bath mat so that my floor doesn't get really wet when i get out of the shower i've got a big towel which is actually like a lot smaller than i thought it was going to be so i'm kind of disappointed two face cloths and uh, a hair towel to wrap my hair in then shall i do kitchen stuff i actually don't have any of my plates except for these two bowls that i have i got a, a massive set of pink and gray obviously big plates little plates and then cereal bowls they're all downstairs because it's stupidly heavy that i cannot bring that upstairs by myself and then what else have we got so i've got this i mean this tag is ridiculous this little oven glove from ikea two chopping boards probably should have found a different color but they were all like bright green and i do not want bright green anything and then i got the most ridiculous looking set of knives you've ever seen in your life for a uni student i promise these weren't expensive they just look stupidly expensive i'm also not going to take all of these with me because i definitely don't need them i got some food clips she's from amazon again nice pastel colors obviously what would you expect else from me <sighs> then very boring washing up stuff this sponge is like a lifesaver you put the washing up liquid in here and as you scrub it like comes out slowly then i have four mugs gray and pink obviously these are from from dunelm they were one pound fifty each and they are very pretty then i bought some metal straws and this was really cool they come with coloured like tops, so if I'm lending them to friends or something, you can put a different colour on your straw and then you know whose drink is whose. I thought that was really clever. Then I have two of these ice cube trays. I am obsessed with ice. I literally have it in every single drink ever. I have my cutlery. It is rose gold. Again, I didn't want to get plain silver. Um, oh, it's actually copper I lied, but this is what it looks like. Um, and I think there's four of each of them. Dishcloths, these are from Amazon. Not Amazon, I meant Ikea. I'm probably gonna need more than these because they probably get really grim. And then I have a few pots and pans. I'm not gonna show you, they're really boring. But this, I thought this was quite cool. So it's a colander, but it folds. Again, this was from Ikea. So it's only this big and it's so much easier to store. I thought I was genius, I'm a genius. I got a garlic clove crush, which I'm probably not gonna use because I've 
gonna buy that already pre-cut garlic because I ain't got time to be crushing garlic. But then I bought this really pretty can opener, which is baby pink. Then I got this little set of wooden utensils, a spoon and two of these spatula thingies. And then these are my cups, glasses. I've also got some wine glasses over there, but they're very boring. And I'm probably gonna keep those in my room anyway because they're my mum's and I don't want to get them smashed. But this is what the glasses look like. Um, annoyingly, they don't stack. Anyway, the last few things I've got to show you are really boring stationary things. Um, we have some pencils, a pucker pad for writing stuff in. But then these are the cutest things ever. I'm not sure how many modules and stuff I'm going to have, but I want to do, like, I think I want to do a folder, like a little folder for each one, rather than a massive folder that I have to bring with me everywhere. So far, I've only bought three of these. One's purple, one's a very, very baby pink, basically white. And this one's baby blue. This is going to start me off, and I'll probably have to get more as I go. And then I got some pastel highlighters and then i got some pens because i genuinely just don't have any pens i think that is the end of the video oh there is one more thing i know this is ridiculous and no uni student actually really needs this maybe except for me because i am a caffeine addict but i also have this <laughs> i actually got given this for my 19th birthday my 19th birth yeah my 19th birthday from my parents specifically for uni and i know it's very extra and that it is the end of the video i hope you enjoyed this and i hope you've had a lovely day subscribe if you've never seen my face before there is loads of uni content coming soon if i don't drop out yeah give this video a massive thumbs up i really appreciate it and i'll see you in the next video bye